Oh yeah, this is fun. Uh uh uh, don't pull that up. I'm gonna sit in the truck around right here. And you can help me, I just put my water boots on. I'm gonna put that bitch right in here on the tire track. And did you bring your tent? Or are you gonna sleep in your truck or your. I didn't bring a tent. Okay. Look at this, look at the water. No, it's beautiful. Shine your light on there. It's beautiful. Look at the smoke. I know. It was like that when I pulled in. Because the water's warmer than the air. Well, I know that. Mm. Look at that island. That's cool looking. Oh, my God. There's a UFO. That's Mars. Never mind. That is fucking cool. Look at that. It's beautiful woods up this river, man. Look at that. All right. I'm going to turn the truck around so we can set the boat off. And then we can turn it back around and let the light be on it. Well, I have to get a couple hours of sleep. Well, where are you? I brought a tent or a mattress. I'm going to sleep in the back of my truck, but we can set You got it your pop up tent? First. You got your little pop up? Yeah. I'll, I'll take that. I'm going to sleep in the back of my truck, but we, we got at least a, an hour. You mean I'm going to be out here by myself? You could sit right next to my truck. You're inside of a fucking shell. I'm in a tent <laughs> the size of your thumb. You got a gun? Oh, yeah. For... Turn the truck around. Shut up, baby. Jesus. Jesus Christ, That's we're on the Withercoochee River in the fucking woods. Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> Look at the goddamn size of the footprints around here. Ugh. Watch out for my truck. Oh my god, it's freezing. Yeah, watch out. Why don't we both sleep in the tent? I told you I didn't want to be uncomfortable. <laughs> I'm uncomfortable. <laughs> That's what I was laughing about. I'm very uncomfortable. I'm sick of Bigfoot. Don't get stuck in that mud. This is nuts. Going up this fucking river in a canoe we've never even been on in the dark. Gators everywhere. Is that one? Three in the morning, we gotta get up in an hour. You need help? <laughs> Putting it back up is the fun part.
We can't block the boat ramp. Just for what we load. Nobody's coming in here. Bullshit, nobody's coming here. What if somebody comes here? Just put it while we're unloading. We'll move it after. Well, I load the boat up. Oh, okay. You mean my stuff, too. Yeah, 10 4. Roger. God, I can't stop yawning. I feel like I'm being watched in this place. Florida, it's seriously cold right now. All right, signing out for a minute. You're taking your climber? Yeah. Why? Because we're gonna go in the woods. What I thought I we were gonna uh, hunt from the boat. Well, we can do both. If I can find a spot I wanna be in. Well, There's plenty of room for the climber. All right, whatever. There's plenty, there's plenty of it. I'm taking my climber. I ain't taking much shit. I got my gun in a backpack. Yeah, there you go. You got the whole front spot. You got from that thing forward. <sighs> you got a bingo cushion for me? I don't think so. But I got a flight jacket. If you don't want to wear it, I'm going to wear mine. I want this big blue cushion. Got the plug in. Never took it out. Oh. oh man. There's Mars. I can't see it now. Too much light. All right. I got video going. I think I'm just going to upload it to YouTube right now. Well, I'll probably wait. Let's see what this looks like over here. Man, when it's cold in Florida, out in the woods, it's freaking cold. All these rivers through Florida, these are corridors for Sasquatch. And the state does a pretty good job of keeping everything natural, too. I mean, it's like millions of acres on both sides of the river. Look at those woods. What is over there? River goes into a swamp. I don't know how cold it is, but it feels like about 48. But it's probably really 55 or 60. Oh, 
People probably come here and picnic here. You know Sasquatch comes and checks out camping spots. There you go, po pose next to your GNU. Hurry up. Got a good shot here. Hurry up, we're live. I'll snap a picture. Stand where right about there. Okay. Ready? That's it. Maybe at Boggy Creek. Boggy Creek. No, we are in the we are in the Withacuchi River in Webster. Uh, I would pull the GNU up further than that. We need to pull this thing way up here in the dirt because it's going to be gone in the morning. All right, all right. I'm going to tie it up. It Just making sure you're not. Uh... It ain't going nowhere. I got to put my boots on so I can step in the water. I'll turn it around after we load it. Well, I'm not going to put anything in until the morning. I only got two things. I'm, 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 I'm just going to put the rest of my couple things in it. I'm going to park right here. Why do you got gloves on? Well, I was touching the motor. I don't want to get oily. All right. Mm -hmm. I thought you were doing that COVID shit again. Some kind of fucking oil on you. This COVID thing is freaking me out. Watching people jogging with their mask on by my house and driving in a car with their mask. Just so everybody knows, you only get sick if you want to get sick. Everything is spiritual in nature. Oh, what is this? Oh, there be little kids' shoes there. And youthful vitality. Can a youthful vitality. That's weird. Right. Are you leaving your truck right here? Huh? All right, I'm going to park behind you, I guess, or to the side of you. Well, if they do come, I can't be blocking it. Some of you may laugh at that, but experiences I've had, I like to have a little control over what happens. And if a Bigfoot's going to come up and look into my window, I'd rather be the passenger window while I'm sleeping, not my driver's window.
That don't look like a raccoon. I don't know what kind of animal that was. All right, I'm right behind you. I'm gonna go lay down. Ugh. Why? Because the, they, cause that's the good part of the ramp if somebody uh, comes, you know? Let's just park right, right there. Right here. Well, why don't we just park right here in the parking lot? The parking lot's over there. You can't park on the grass. Well, you can park right here. Yeah, go ahead. I'll park right next to you. All right. It's dark as hell when you turn the light off here. Right, I'm gonna get a couple hours of rest. Hey, look. on that tree right there. Looks like a mask or a head. Oh my god. Look at that. What the fuck? Do you see that? Dude, what is that? Look at these pilings coming up out of the water. What the fuck? There's another one. Dude, that is weird. The one back there is really pronounced. It looked like a column going up into the sky. I thought I was seeing something. What the hell? It's an odd bank over there, isn't it? Looks like an old seawall. 
it's not though. Hey, there's more water going that way. Yeah, we're going that way. Oh, that's where the river goes. Two hundred miles. <clears throat> we got enough gas? I didn't sleep at all last night. Not me. River monsters. Could be anything in this water. This is the kind of shit Jeremy Wade comes and fishes. Somebody's got the tree marked right there. Oh, there's nothing there though, it's only a point. Oh, that's why he's got it marked right there. No more columns of smoke. YouTube subscribers, look, what? YouTube subscribers, don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, That's right. look right here doing for you, suffering, suffering could have been, we could have been working today, <laughs> by the way, if any of my customers are waiting for their equipment i'm just taking a day off i'm working the weekend i'm off on the weekday i'm working on the weekends yeah just be patient why is yeah but why is it going up and down Oh well, yeah, look at this current. That's kind of weird. That's odd how there's heat coming off the river on this spot, but nowhere else. I froze to death last night. I didn't want to start the truck up and wake you up. I wanted to so bad. I warmed up the truck before I went to sleep. I was warm as hell. I slept like a baby, man. Until about an hour ago. There is no getting comfortable in the front of my truck. I uh, lay down. I, got, I put four inches of freaking mats underneath me. I, mean, I could sit in a chair at home and fall asleep, but I yeah. can't sit in that yeah. that seat I can't. What is that thing right there? There's a Bigfoot crouched down. Burgundy Bigfoot. We don't we don't shoot those. They're amazing. Get out anywhere. 
Let's go another 100 miles first before we get out. If we didn't have guns, they'd be standing on the side of the bank. Waiting for you to beat them. Give them a marshmallow. I can't believe there is no nobody on kayaks or canoes, nothing. Everybody's home playing with YouTube, bleeding on their kitchen counter. There's another column right there. It's not very, can't very see it very well though. <coughs> That's gotta be like a hot spring back there. Oh, it was definitely in the 50s. It's definitely in the 50s. I'm warm. Sweating. Well, that's because you're sitting behind me. All right, I gotta stop filming because my hand is freaking. My hands are like ice. And it's a nice river, ain't it? Plus, I gotta get ready to kill something. Well, it's hopefully there's nothing in this water that's gonna turn our boat over like last time. High, the water comes up there. Look at the trees. can't walk what part huh? what part we can't walk I can't hear you. what part can we walk we can walk all of this on oh. either side we don't move around the road we can't get through because it gets to be too quick so we can get through look at that down in there see a killer whale orca coming in from the gulf side gulf. turn this boat around <clears throat> that wouldn't stop him we are 200 miles up the river from the gulf of mexico well yeah it could be it that long all these winding There's something big right there. There's something under the water right there.
No. How deep the water gets in here at the tree levels. Whoa, shit. <laughs> Just not saw that log in the water. I thought it was something big coming in. <clears throat> Somebody cut that tree down a long time ago. Look at that. Yeah, you wouldn't want to roll in this car. Yeah, we'd be screwed if that motor kicked out. For some reason, my GPS just beeped, so we might be on near a hunting spot. Look at those elephant ears right there. That's weird. That means a free deer stand. Where? Oh, yeah, right there. Might be an old deer stand left back in there. Abandoned. Those are some nice woods to the left over there. I like those. See, look, there's more of those elephant ears over there. See that? Those used to be all over the place in Florida. You don't see much anymore. Look at that. That's where we should go, right in there. I'm afraid to put the camera down, I might miss something. I know. I'm afraid to stop because I might miss something. Really Park, we need to park someplace like we just passed back there. Hey, we're going with the current. Let's see what it's like to paddle. Was that your GPS or mine? I gotta go look at it and see why it's doing that. Yeah, but we don't walk back this far to the river. Look how that reflects on that water.
he tries that again, you shoot him. Lewis, why do you come on these trips with me? Lewis? Yeah, baby. Like, share, and subscribe. He's, he's my media man back there. There's a big sign up here in the water. Oh, yeah. Danger. Danger. Rapid rapids. Waterfall. 60 foot waterfall straight down. If you can read this, you cannot, you already cannot turn around. Call for help now. Why does it say call for help now? With the Coochie State Forest. That big old boulder. I see something there. Was that a brochure or something? A boulder. I right there in the water. Or is that a stump? That's a stump. That's a stump. You're going to run us up ground. Yeah, let's, too yeah. let's just go past that grass. Yeah, get us out of here because it's all flooded in here and I gotta I gotta pee like a racehorse. Come on, turn us around. Oh my god. Wow, look at that. Gotta be in a good spot, like over there. Over there, not here. Over there. Uh, I don't see any tracks, but it's sure. Yeah, these are good woods up in here. I looked on a GPS. Bill. I don't want to go flying off this thing.
going the wrong way. Hey, we should walk down there and see if we can kill something. We should walk down there and see if there's a deer standing in there. There ain't nobody here. Yeah, we got pretty good luck with big bucks standing right there. My Jeep. My GPS went off again. Let's go over here. We've been in these places before because my GPS has marked them. Well, somebody's getting here. With a car. Go over here because somebody might pull their truck up in here. Huh? There's an alligator up here. Where did he go? What the hell is that? What the hell is that? Oh, that piece of tin. Thought it was somebody's dork. Look at those woods. Oh, there is. Because I walked right up on a hunter out there. He's on his YouTube. Here Say hello to the YouTube subscribers. Like, share, and subscribe, even if you don't like it.
I got an eagle eye. Something spooky about being by yourself going on a dead end road where all the Sasquatch sightings are. Truck sound like it's getting ready to stall. Ass road.
one thing about running your video recorder, when it's running, you can be sure nothing's gonna happen. That's my experience. and millions of people in Florida and I'm the only one back here. Discovered something. The chimney we got a, in the middle of the woods. Really good game trail. And uh, this is Eric Mothman reporting. Come on. The Mothman. team man. Team leader for a box of monsters. Team leader. Go ahead and uh, subscribe and get your shirt. Don't forget to buy your shirt. They're available for purchase. This is a, a DUMB, a dumb, a deep underground military base. Something like an elevator to get us down to the center of the earth or something. It's a breathing tube. It's uh, in a pretty odd spot. There's no doubt about it. Well, you know, at nighttime, some, there's two of them. Yeah, there's two of them. The ground opens up and a big radar comes out of the ground. And that's how they catch UFOs coming in from the Gulf of Mexico. Not really, but that shit does does exist. It's a vent for an underground base. 
That's what I was saying. They're about to be taken in. I mean, they, they were already about to crack them. About to grab them. I hope they got a drink and a shower in there. This is the one with the reptilian writing on it because it's not, it's not a human base. These are bat boxes. It's a bat box. Bat roost. You know how much work it took to get that thing in here? <sighs> the camera up there and keep it in the back. Race it in, put it in there and raise it up and turn it up. Hey. Like this. I'll give you $20 if you stand in there. Get the money out. Stand in there. How about if I look up there? I'll look up in there for free. No bat species, not much. So look in there with your camera. Turn your. Did camera. you hear that? Did yeah. you hear that? Put your camera in there like this, so you can see if there's any in there. My light's not on. I don't think it comes on unless it's dark. Somebody backpacked that whole thing up this road, man. <sighs> There's definitely got to be some bats in there. Somebody really want, there's, no, there's nothing in there. There's no feces on the ground or nothing. My light's not coming on. I don't think it's any good. It's defective. Did you hear that return knock? Yes, I did. This is a pretty spooky looking woods here. Isn't it? You got some flow here. There's another one of those uh, things sticking up. Is there? Yeah. Think the bats naturally survive good in, the, in this world? You need you need them out because so many mosquitoes. Where's another one? Where's one? Oh, one of those things. I don't know what that is. Some water level indicator. We ain't crossing this. Nope. See, see how close we are to the Swanee. We are exactly a half mile. Uh, 0.62 of a mile. Oh. Well, let's walk back and walk across that dry over to that to that spot that I know, the head that I know, cause I, and then we'll go back out that other road. And then I will have circled this whole thing and know whether or not I want to hunt in here or not. You can hunt this road and I'd hunt the other one. Okay. We ain't crossing this, that's for sure. If you can cross it, it's going to be pretty wet. Probably covered in leeches, too. Don't trip in here. You trip here, you're going to die.
hot. Oh my god. The hogs are in deer crossing that river. Yep. They sure are. Yep. All kinds of tracks. Come on. Show them the skull. Come, come, come. The YouTubers at home. You want me to pick it up? Yeah, pick it up. Hey, there's this fucking back. Some people live in the UK. They, you know, they don't have no woods to go into. It's a hog skull. Queen mums don't let them do anything. Know, it's a hog skull. That's a dead doe. That looks like a deer. Yep, mm -hmm. it's a deer. There's his jaw. Oh no, it's a hog. Oh, might be, yeah. That's a hog. Hmm. I'm taking it with me. Put it up next to your head. So the size and difference in the brain. Your brain's a little bit bigger. Not much. You're sick. I'm not doing that. It not showing anybody. Oh my god, there's a whole freaking stack of them. This is gonna be next. Really? Not really. I wanna know what ate all the skin off of it. Like it acid dipped it. If you want to know why we're walking slow like this, my GPS doesn't work. Mm. If we don't take one of them things to the chest. Me and Billy woke up one day and we were old. Yep. Mm. I've known Billy since eighth grade. 40 years. We've outlasted many a relationship. <laughs> Ex-wives couldn't keep up with us. Not even the current one. Oh. Oh. Oh, Jesus. Oh. I just stepped on like okay, straight across eight of them. I guess. We gotta be getting to that head somewhere. I said, oh, I'm gonna turn it to 26 to 28. Great spirit, can you make it cold for us, please? Thought that might have been a swimming pool for a gnome, but no. There's no water in it. This crossbow is ridiculously heavy. What's this big mound of dirt here for?
Why don't you let me walk first? Great spirit, please lower the temperature. Don't laugh, it's worked for me several times before. One time it was so cold, we are blown. Blowing smoke right out of the rails. Condensation. Who had a flip flop out here? There's no tracks. There's a couple there. We are way down upon the Swanee River. Right what? That's where we pulled up with the news. I know. Tommy's is over there. I know. It's over there. Tommy's is over there. Right, right. Yeah. It's a little bit more further that way to the Tommy's. Oh my god, feel that air. Oh, he's jumping that water. I think they can go swim in here. Oh, yeah. It looks beautiful. Oh, yeah. I think I, I definitely. I mean, there's river monsters, but what's the chance of being one right here? Right there. Probably. Waiting for somebody to come near the edge. You got an alligator or a turtle. And then there's sturgeons in here, big ones. We can throw the boat in right here. My boat and canoe. That's what it's for. It's for. You just got to be out of here before at night, though. Not really, though. They'll just lock the you gate. spent the night here before they yeah. locked the gate. This is what we should be doing, bro. We slept this... in my truck. Here. I thought we'd be hunting in our boats this year. You didn't, you didn't bring your boat. Well, for now on, we're not coming up here without the boat. Mine's with me. My motor, I brought everything. I mean, we should be camping out hunting down the river. Anywhere. Anywhere on the Swanee River. Just where the bank is. What is tomorrow? Friday? No. Tomorrow's Friday. You need to be out here Saturday morning. That's when the near the riverbank here. Because that's when all the hunters are gonna push the shit in there. What is that? Going that way. Look at that. Um there's not gonna be that many hunters there. It's, uh, it's archers. People don't there's not that many people here. The thing is when it's gun season. All those private lands, then they hunt dogs and shit on there, and then the animals move off of that on here.
Look it up. You ready, Starman? Let's go. a gate. Did you see it? That's the one I was on yesterday. <clears throat> I know Tommy's got to stand back in there. I've seen it. Well, we went by it twice. You didn't see my ground. I built a ground blind. Intuition tells me that there are just no big bucks to our right side over this right. But that's they're probably there. I know people go down here, down that off that way. I've seen people do it. A little parking area here to your right and here's the tramp trail. Just seen them go down it, but I've never that's one spot I've never walked. CC 1701 to 8675309. Okay, thanks, 1891. Go ahead. using my GPS always. NCC 1701 to 8675309, Papa Tango Charlie. Charlie Tango Delta Sierra UFO When I called the uh, highway patrol and that guy at the Cadillac who's boat fell off and I ran over it. I was calling in his tag and she's military and she's and evidently I'm not. And she was correcting me every time I'd say a letter. She would say the correct call for it. 
But I got to the U. I couldn't think of one for UFO, so I said, U for UFO. I know most of them because that is a phenolic alphabet in our plane when you're. So I know most of it. I can't think of the one for. You know, uniform. It's U, uniform. I thought it was Ulysses. No, it's uniform. <laughs> Underwriters. I used to know them all. I studied the whole thing. Uh, X-ray. Uh, you for eucalyptus. Papa, Charlie, Alpha, November. If you're one of my subscribers, don't unsubscribe yet because it does get better. Alpha, Bravo, Charlie, Echo. Gate number five. Well, these aren't the ugliest woods I've ever seen. This is what Florida hunting is like, folks. It's difficult, it's hot. Tremendous amount of bugs and flying insects. Poisonous snakes. Flesh eating diseases. Black tide. Hurricanes. Hey, right here, this body of water to our left. This is special. Stop right here. They got uh, some kind of a fish feeder in there, and it's definitely filled with fish. Yeah, that's always there. That's, that's what I was looking at with that fish feeder. And the, there's sometimes thousand fish in there. I got the net. Are <laughs> uh, you thinking what I'm thinking? I'm thinking they probably wouldn't appreciate you taking their fish. Well, isn't that what they're for? I don't think so. You're not gonna eat them. You're just gonna kill them. You're gonna leave them on the side of the road. Of course, I'm gonna eat them. I eat fish. Freshwater fish. That would be a wantful, willful waste of wildlife, and that is illegal. I could pull my net up, they could have otters in there, baby alligators, a couple sturgeons, and uh, catfish. That'd be quite a haul. I don't know what kind of fish there are, but I have definitely seen baby alligators and otters in there, in that little pond. Well, I was here, last time I was here, somebody was throwing fish food in there or something, and that water was boiling. There's so many fish in there. Boiling. Yeah, I've seen that many fish in there. 
don't know what they are, though. I don't know why I didn't stop and, uh, I don't know, I didn't feel like I was uh, welcome or something, so I just kept going. It puzzles me why I didn't stop and investigate. I mentioned this is Florida hunting woods. This is hot, sweaty, buggy, flying insects, flesh eating disease, black tide, traffic jams in Florida. In case you're thinking about moving here, it's horrendous. It's not like you're out in Oregon or Washington, California, Nevada, Nebraska, all those places. The deer are staying out in the fields. You can eat an ice cream cone in a twisty tweet, and you're gonna see bucks out there. You move to Florida, you're not going to kill a buck that easy. Here you gotta sit for endless, endless hours and days in a deer stand. Sometimes you go a whole season, you don't get one chance. Thinking about moving to Florida and bringing your hunting career down here, be prepared. I'm not trying to black you out or anything, but I've been out west, and uh, that hunting out there is just, you don't even need camouflage, you don't need no buck sense attractors or anything, they're just there. I think you're right, King. I got an arrow in my knock. You got an arrow in your cock. Should I stop, take my arrow out, or what? It just seems lifeless. Oh great, my air just shut off. What the hell was that all about? My air just stopped blowing for a couple seconds for no reason. My night's cold, I just recharged and evacuated and changed the orbit to but man, I have to keep turning it off. It's so cold in here. What the hell does that mean? Why would the blower just stop for no reason? Look at this, I'm looking like a mile ahead of the truck and there's no deer in the road, nothing running across, nothing. I don't like it. but there's some interesting terrain to the left. Look how deep, how deep, not the first ditch, but the one after it is big.
there's a ribbon, which means a free beer stand. Eucalyptus. scrub oaks to the left. Oh yeah. Scrub Oaks alert. You know, you, you put a, if you put a stand on the road right here, a big box walk through there. They cross the road. There's no acorns, is there? To go check is that there's acorns on the ground, that's where they're bedding down at. Woods to the right. The gate, 
right there. That's the one I wanted to go down. Oh, no, it ain't. That ain't in it either. What the fuck? I don't know where it is. Keep going. Imagine all the game we're gonna see in our my Tesla Cyber Truck makes zero sound. Wow, there's the first hog sign to the left. Look at that. Yep, first fresh hog sign right there. Said they're probably moved in up here. I'm gonna find that trail. That's where the hogs. That's why I wanted to walk down it because I know that one has all had a bunch of hogs. I think I'm on the wrong road, though. Yeah, but there's the highway up here about a quarter mile up. And yeah, that ain't it either. It must have been the next one. Oh well. <sighs> that gate on the right that's that would be a good spot
seen big bucks in those kind of woods to our left, big ones. park on the side of the highway here and go in where it looks good because it's so deep in the woods nobody goes there and that's where they're all at. Yeah, you can go in there. People park on the side of the road. You'll see them there in gun a little dirt road with no gate. can't stand these pine, planted pine tree forests, like on the left. I mean, it just ruins, ruins everything. Ninety percent of our woods are destroyed so they can have pizza boxes. Did you know 177,000 acres a year are decimated just to make pizza boxes. And they're not recyclable because they don't use the wax paper lining. Did you know that? That's a fact. Ran over a rattlesnake. Right next to me. 